Following months of teasing, Rolls-Royce has revealed its first ever electric car, the new Spectre Coupe. If ever a brand was suited to electrification, Rolls-Royce is it, and indeed its co-founder Charles Stuart Rolls identified that as long ago as 1900 when he quipped, the electric car is perfectly noiseless and clean, there is no smell or vibration, they should become very useful when fixed charging stations can be arranged. Hence the company's prophecy fulfilled tagline. Up front, what appears to be a traditional Rolls-Royce grille is wider than in any previous model from the firm, and it's lit from behind. As there's no engine to cool, the grille's polished stainless steel vanes are smooth, designed to push air around the car. Indeed, the Spectre has the lowest drag coefficient of any Rolls-Royce yet at 0.25. Even the famous Spirit of Ecstasy figurine has been re-sculpted. Either side of the grille are sharp, almost horizontal LED daytime running lights, while the main driving lights below appear dark when not in use. The whole arrangement looks imperious, imposing and upright from some angles, but in the side view it's possible to see the sloping bonnet and the curve of the grille and wings. Meanwhile, the upright side panels contrast with the deliciously sloping roofline and rear window line, while the muscular haunch extends sharply over the rear wheels, which are 23 inches in diameter. The doors are hinged at the back and the side glass is compact, an approach that extends to the minimal rear lights. Inside, special illumination takes centre stage as the established starlight headlining feature is joined by a similar design on the doors, while the Spectre name on the passenger side of the dashboard is surrounded by 5,500 stars of its own when the car is switched on. The dashboard itself is an all-digital affair, running with the Rolls-Royce Spirit architecture that interfaces with the Whispers smartphone app. The Spectre is the first car from the firm to allow tailoring of the digital side of things via the bespoke commissioning process. Fancy matching the colours of your digital dials to your Spectre's leather or paint colours? No problem. Indeed, Rolls-Royce confirms the Spectre's interior suite offers clients near-infinite bespoke possibilities. There is also room for four inside the Spectre cabin, and yes, there are umbrellas hidden to the front of the doors. Gone are the days when Rolls-Royce didn't deign to confirm how powerful or fast its cars were, but even so, the Spectre's specifications have not all been finalised. We're told there's up to 900 newton meters of torque and 585 horsepower on tap, which we presume comes from a dual motor all-wheel drive layout. A 0-100 km per time of 4.5 seconds is expected by Rolls-Royce, despite the car's 2,975 kg weight. Not that Rolls-Royce buyers are likely to be concerned by such things, but a preliminary energy consumption figure of 21.5 kWh per 100 km results in a range of 520 km. That suggests a usable battery pack size well over 100 kWh. In terms of size, the Spectre is longer and wider than the Rolls-Royce Cullinan SUV, but shorter than the Phantom. It will be priced between the two, and buyers can now begin the ordering process for first deliveries at the end of 2023.